Good morning, everyone, and we're into the last week of the half term. Um, it's freezing out here today, so um, no doubt you're, you're all best tucked up at home. Stay nice and warm, stay, stay cosy in your houses. Uh, final week then of COVID calm, so we've got something every day going on. And usual format, we'll be, we'll be seeing some interesting facts from Mrs. Lount shortly. And then loads of shout outs today. They've all flown in over the weekend. So make sure you're having a good weekend. Uh, hopefully you had a good weekend. Make sure you're having a brilliant week. Don't forget Wednesday Wellbeing Day and Friday afternoon that you have some family fun. And then we have a week where there'll be no work set. There'll be no learning at home. You'll be having time to chill out and um, have a nice relaxing time. Let's see what the weather does. Who knows, we may get more snow or not. We'll see what's coming. All right, let's get going today. Fact one. Hello everyone, it's Mrs. Lamb here. I'm going to share my three interesting facts with you. The first one is, I'm really scared of pigeons. I was once walking down the high street in Newcastle and one flew into me and since then I really don't like them. Fact two. My second very interesting fact is that when I was at primary school I always used to win the sack race and it was because I had a special um, skill. I used to jump sideways and it makes you faster to try it. <laughs> fact, fact, three. Fact, fact, three. fact three. And my third interesting fact is that I have very, very skilled eyebrows. So as I said right at the start with um, today's COVID cam, we've got loads of shout outs and mainly from year four. So let's get going. Uh, Mason Basser in 4B. Mason sent an amazing video of his facts about Pompeii. Pompeii. Um, his video was so good and filled with accurate facts about the eruption of Mount Vesuvius that Mrs. Barnes uses facts to inspire the English lesson that they did on Friday. So well done, Mason. Great job there. Poppy Wickens completing some amazing maths work. She's used a brilliant method to help her solve some tricky multiplication questions. So well done, Poppy. Scarlett, Scarlett B, handing in work every day and always trying her best. She's drawn some lovely pictures for the other lessons this week too as well, so well done. Um, Harry Baker, Belisa and Caden for always doing their best work because they've been in school, um, so they've been getting on doing a great job as well. And we've got Brooke, Layla, Zach, Peyton, Mia, Helena, Summer, Georgia and Neve always sending in work of a very high standard so the year four team are really impressed by everything you're doing there so well done um, keeping going with year four Kaylin and Layton amazing reading and maths work sent in last week so well done to you guys and Oscar using the voiceover tool to complete his work in English he's found a way to present his work that works for him and never gives up so well done Oscar um, Jasmine an excellent poster for the Wellbeing Wave and Kiva one of our new pupils listening so well to advice to help her with her maths she's getting the head round maths no problem because it's a brand new item for her um, and we've got Morsese sending in excellent maths work great methods for multiplication and detailed explanations so great job to you we've also got a shout out for Scarlett Charlton who's made a fantastic Roman shield and um, the year falls are really impressed with it Charlotte uh, Scarlett and Mum has even told Mrs. Marwick that she worked really hard on it. Lovely seeing the smile on your face. There's a photo coming up right now. And finally, we've got a shout out that's um, for Mrs. Barnes. Can you ask Mr. Mottram on Monday if he can give my mum and dad a shout out for helping me with my work and being so supportive. Um, and they've been doing a brilliant job. And that is from Mia Wilson. So there we go. There's our shout outs for today.